I'm Ryoma, an introverted loner in junior year high school. My family's so poor that I can't even eat proper meals. Each day, I try to disguise my hunger by spending my time reading books in class. I'm so hungry. Hey, Bone Boy! No food again? How poor can you be? That's hilarious. That's why you're such a skeleton. These three are Yuzu, Aki, and Marina. They make fun of me for being poor whenever they feel bored. Them again? How much time do they have? Must ignore. You ignoring us? Pretty cocky for a bone boy. Maybe he can even talk from the hunger. <laughs> You're, You're so, so funny. funny. <laughs> Just hurry up and leave me alone. What do you want? Oh, nothing. We just want to make fun of the Bone Boy. Yeah? Teasing you is so much fun! Alright, let's try arm wrestling. Huh? Of course not! If you beat me, I'll buy you lunch. You sure you aren't lying? Fine, I'll do it. Ready? Go. <clears throat> huh? Are you even trying? Come on. Uh, damn it! I have no energy from the hunger! <laughs> what a loser! I'm next! Ready? Go! <laughs> You're so weak. I'm last in line. Just try your best, will you? Ready? Go! <laughs> huh? Are you really trying? <laughs> You're so lame. You can't even beat girls. You're so weak. If I just ate enough food, these girls would be nothing! I'm back. Welcome home. Are you heading off to your part-time already? Yep. Don't you want to eat dinner first? It's okay. I have to get going, and they'll give me food after work. I see. I'm sorry for always being a burden. It's nothing, Mom. I'll be off. My family consists of my mother and me, and we're very poor. That's why each day, I work at several different part-time jobs after school and early in the morning. But it's only natural to help my mother who worked to the bone in order to raise me until now. All right, I'll head to my morning job and then go to school. Thanks as always. Are you not eating breakfast? I'm running short on time, so it's okay, Mom. You should eat up. But you've gotten so skinny. I'm fine, don't worry. I've been getting food at my job and eating snacks and stuff. Oh crap, I'm running late. See you later. See you. I'm sorry, Ryoma. Even though you're at an age where you should be enjoying a life. I'll be starting your last block of the day. First, I need to announce some bad news. The meal fees I collected from everyone yesterday have disappeared. Huh? Does that mean someone stole it? Isn't that a crime? That's horrible! Isn't Yuzu's group suspicious? They're always around in class after school's over. True. They always keep talking about how they don't have money and can't have fun. But aren't they always buying new makeup and bags? Yuzu, Aki, Marina, what do you think? Huh? It's not us. Why us? You don't have any evidence. Why are you accusing us like that? We didn't steal anything. They sure do seem like the type who do it. Then who else could have done it? If they're denying it that much, I guess it couldn't be them. Despite how annoying they are, I feel a bit bad for them. Would the class let me off if I told them I did it since I'm so poor? Alright. Sir, I'm so sorry. I was the one who stole it. Huh? I see. Ryoma, please come to the staff office. Sure. As for the rest, head home after listening to any other announcements the assistant might have. So it was that broke guy who stole it. What a piece of trash. He's a criminal. What a bother. That bastard. This is why people with no money are... Uh. <sighs> I understand your family situation, which is why I'll let you off the hook this one time. However, be sure to return what you stole. Yes, sir. I'm sorry. I'll definitely return the money. Be sure to never do this again. Yes, I understand. <sighs> the money, huh? What should I do? Should I increase the number of jobs? Hey, you weren't the one who stole the meal fees, were you? Huh? Um... Don't lie. We'll kill you if you do. Well, I didn't, but... Why? Why did you cover for us when we're always teasing you? I'm always taught by my mom to help anyone who's in trouble. And you guys are always bothering me, so of course I can tell if you're lying or not. Huh? The 
Thanks. I see. Thanks. Thanks for helping us. No worries. Oh crap! I have to head to part-time! You work part-time? Of course I do! You know my family is extra poor, don't you? Plus, I have to make up for the stolen meal fees as well. Huh? That's... See ya! What should we do? It's our fault, isn't it? We have to do something for Bone Boy! I'm so hungry... Hey, Bone Boy! No food again? Guess they're back to make fun of me again. They never get bored of it, do they? Here you go. Have some if you want. Hey, just take it, will you? Huh? What are these? We made lunch boxes for you. You'll eat them, right? I won't forgive you if you don't finish it! What's with them? All right, there must be something bad inside. No, I'm alright. What? Just shut up and eat! Aki, Marina, open up his mouth! Got it! Open up, Bone Boy! Come on, just open wide! What's with you guys? I'll get a stomachache! Huh? It's perfectly edible. So, how's my lunchbox? Well, it tastes pretty good. It's not fair! My lunchbox tastes great too! Hurry up and eat it! Hurry up and eat! I also did my best with mine, so eat it! Alright, I got it. I'll eat all of your boxes, so calm down! In the end, I ended up finishing three portions worth of lunchboxes. Oof, thanks for the food. It was really good. That's good to hear. We'll make you food every day from now on, so you better finish them every time. Look forward to them, alright? Sure. Am I gonna eat three portions every day? From that day onwards, my days consisted of eating their lunch boxes at lunch break and working in the morning and after school. As a result, my body transformed from skinny to muscular. Bone boy, your arms are crazy. I mean, you aren't even a bone boy anymore. You've become so cool. All right, all right, it's almost time for work, so let me go. While I was trying to leave, we heard something from the hallway. Dave, someone catch him! Huh? As I quickly opened the door, a male student dashed in front of me with a girl's wallet in his hand. Wait! I began running after him on instinct. As the student was about to run past the school store... Stop right there! The store's part-timer tried to stop him by jumping in front of him, but... Get out of my way! Oh no! The part-timer was smashed away by the student. Yes! I can get away! I got you! Damn it! We finally caught up! Wait, Bone Boy, you caught him? Macho Bone Boy is amazing! Yeah, so isn't he no longer a boy boy? I'm so sorry. My family is very poor and we don't even have enough food, so... He's much like you, Ryoma. He came from a poor household and there's plenty of room for sympathy. I see. Also, I'm the one who stole the meal fees. I was so hungry that before I realized it, I'd stolen them. But in the end, I couldn't spend them out of guilt. I'll return the full amount, so please forgive me. So that's what that was. Return the full amount and never do it again. There won't be a second time. Yes, sir. I'm so sorry. It's kind of you to cover for people, but try not to go overboard. <laughs> I'll be careful. As such, my false accusation was rectified, and I no longer had to return the meal fees. We almost never brought over so many friends. I'm so surprised. These are my friends. Bone Boy, you're horrible. You better thank us for coming all the way over to your house to feed you on a holiday. You better finish all of it. Alright, I got it. Just stop forcing it down my throat. I've never seen Ryoma look so happy before. Girls, feel free to stay as long as you want. Okay. We'd, we'd love to keep you company. What a lucky guy you are with pretty girls surrounding you on all sides. Ah, shut up! Can't you at least leave me alone on a holiday? Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani People here! We'd love to hear your thoughts, too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon!